So today I have a very interesting video for you guys. If you go to the Instagram's website, you'd see that there are certain limitations on those websites and certain things that you cannot do right now. That is number one, it cannot see the stories of the people that you follow and upload pictures and videos. As you can see, as the title goes, we're just going to solve one of those problems today. We will use a Chrome extension to see the stories of the people that you follow and also the people that you do not follow, but provided you have the username. So you can just type in the username and also see this story. Okay, so to get started, first of all, we'll head over and open up Chrome. So in Chrome, you just go in into Instagram.com and log into your Instagram account. So there we have, we have the Vindradika Instagram account open. So the first thing that you need to do is go ahead and search for the Chrome Web Store because you need to download an extension. So when you are done with that, open the Chrome Web Store and search for Chrome IG Story. So there you go and there's the first one which says the Chrome IG Story. Now this is the best one that I found right now that works with this system. So we'll just head over and click add to Chrome, add extension. So as you can see the Chrome IG Story has been added to Chrome. So okay so now we can go back to the instagram tab and refresh the page and now you have the stories coming up on the top over here as you can see it appears as a scrollable bar so you can just open up any story and look through it okay so as you can see there's no timer stuff that you usually get on your phone you can also head over and hit the extension icon over there at the top and you can also see the stories from here over here you can also go ahead and type any username over here so this is my personal account and you can just search for that person and also see their stories as you can see there's also a download button which you get a zip file of all the stories that that person currently has uploaded to their instagram account so if there's just one picture you just get one picture however if there are multiple pictures you get a zip file that gets downloaded onto your computer for you to view so that's pretty much it from this video. Thank you guys for watching this video and if you find this video interesting and useful don't forget to hit the like button down below and don't forget to share this video with other people who might also benefit from these kind of content. If you want to see more videos of this kind don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below and as always I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.